look and see if you see footprints, all right? Miss Griffin, look at that one right there. We were uh, are given this, this, uh, this uh, intercession task to do. And so all of us had to come up with something something for them to do for a week. The kids to do for a week. It had to be science and math related. Had to be fun, engaging, because we want the kids to come back, you know, each day. It's part of intercession here at uh, Crispus Attics. Uh, it is a week long. Um, here uh, we are Woodrow Wilson Fellows and we had a program planned for them for the whole week. Each day we're dealing with each discipline of uh, chemistry, uh, technology, physics, biology and mathematics. We came up with an idea of doing the CSI theme and then the tiger being missing. So that would be something that we could tie into each of our disciplines and find some activities that the kids would enjoy and uh, like doing and also learn science along the way. When the event took place that the tiger was actually removed from Christmas Attics, where was this man that you think might be in charge of crime? He was probably here when I was sleeping, in here. So these students have elected to be here, which means, you know, they gave up watching TV, staying up all night, sleeping until noon, to come to school and do this. So one, we have to rise to the challenge to create something worth doing that for. And there was some a tire around. And then all the way down there and too. And bike marks coming all the way down. But I think what, everything you got to tell me, we need to write this stuff down because it's going to help us figure out That's what, what it doing. is. They're just pulling things together. It's really getting them to think. Um, really getting them to look at the facts and think openly. Um, it's it's certainly not a, just a knowledge content based session. They're actually having to assimilate and compile the evidence that they've gathered. You'll have to ask him what shoe size. There you go, math baby. We talked about what we had done. How would the skills that I possess be used to solve a crime? And the math people did the same thing. And then we just, we really worked backwards with what we wanted to accomplish and then worked forward to what that would then look like. Kids at this age, middle school, they just love a challenge. They love somebody to challenge them. They love, you know, the competition. So um, we thought that it would be really great. I don't think it was her. She just no, 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 no. Of course, you know, as a school teacher, I certainly try and I take this approach also. But uh, the benefit of it making a, a whole week long, uninterrupted project um, is just really neat. We have the time, it's uninterrupted. Uh, it's, it's just a, it's a great opportunity for the students to really, to, for them to learn.